if we focus on the equity markets, I think one of the things that is uh, I believe in that I don't necessarily feel is socialized among professional investors is just how biased the return opportunities are on the long side. Um, and this was not always the case, but every professional investor I know in equities makes almost all of their money on the long side, which does not mean that they shouldn't be trading long and short. Uh, because there are certain benefits to doing that. But the idea of making money on the short side may have existed 20 years ago. Now it's a myth. And there are reasons for that. Uh, if you sit down and think about it, 98, 99% of the economic entities, individuals, and enterprises that have the ability to impact stock pricing benefit when stocks go up. And I'm not just talking about fund managers, I'm talking about CEOs and regulators even, and politicians and investment bankers. That's a hell of a tailwind. And the reason that I bring that up is that um, in general, while I do believe long short trading is very appropriate, I do see the performance returns on the long side, which means when you go through periods of difficulty here, it really becomes about preserving capital so that you can buy stuff cheap. Because if you think you're going to um, sell Apple at 210 and ride it down to 170 and that that's going to be an easy trade, it's not. 